So we're continuing now with lesson 15 of our step-by-step uh, -step tutorial. So if we were to go to working preview right now and click on the map button, nothing yet would happen because all we've done for the map button is add an event handler to close the window down, but we haven't done anything to set focus to that panel. So let's go back to design mode and um, scroll down until we get to the map button and click on the smart field to open up the um, uh, action JavaScript editor for the click event and currently we only have one action which is to hide the window so let's go and add our next action which is going to be to place a marker on the map so we'll go here and then we'll say uh, map and we'd like to choose this category called um, Google Map Methods for a UX component and this brings up uh, the builder so the map that we'd like to talk to is called map now in this particular case there we've only got one map on this UX component but in you could actually have multiple maps uh, on the component and so you'd need to specify here which map you're talking to so again in this case there is only one map and the action that we'd like to choose and there are quite a few actions that we can choose from here is simply to add a marker to the map so uh, where do we want to get the ad the address of the marker we could type in an explicit address here like 36 Bigelow Street Cambridge Mass but we want to read um, the address from controls that are currently on the component so we'll choose that and then we can choose uh, the smart field here to bring up a builder and we want to choose which fields we'd like to read the address from so we would like to read the address from the address control the city control and the country control so those three controls will be read uh, to get the address and then we can choose some uh, marker settings so for example we can click on the smart field here and we could say that uh, we'd like to say um, animate um, and we'd like to maybe bounce the marker for um, um, uh, one second after it's been placed on on the map so let's go ahead now and then click OK click OK again so now we've got two actions in our action JavaScript but we still uh, haven't given focus to the map panel itself so let's go here and add a third action called uh, panel actions and again we'll go there and we'll say that we'd like to set the active panel and this time we're going to choose the panel underbar map so now we've got three different actions in our action JavaScript let's save this now go to working preview click on the first row now go to map and that brings the uh, map into focus and you can see that as the map came into focus the mark was still bouncing around so let's go back to a different customer let's go to uh, this customer here in Mexico City now go to the map uh, click on map you can see now the map comes up and uh, the animation is taking place and we're now looking at the um, we're looking at the uh, map um, uh, with the marker for Mexico but let's go back now you can see that this map is not completely filling the panel card that it's in so let's go back to the panel that has the map and you can see there's a property now called fill container so now this map is going to completely fill the container so let's go back again now to working preview and see uh, if we can see any difference so go to menu now click on map and you can see now the map is completely filling the panel card uh, that it's on. Um, now you can also see that if I drag on the uh, header here that we're going back to the previous uh, panel. Now that's not the behavior that we want and the reason that we're getting that behavior is that we still haven't changed the um, the um, um, uh, navigation method for the top level panel navigator. So when we initially placed this panel navigator here uh, at the beginning of the lessons when we started mobilizing this component and we chose panel navigator the default uh, navigation method for all navigators is carousel so we want to go ahead here and make that programmatic because we're not navigating from panel to panel uh, by dragging on the panels we're choosing buttons and doing everything programmatically so let's go back now and test this out and you can see now that when we go to the map that uh, everything is working correctly we can't scroll back thank you